Learning hybrid photography one day at a time. Become a smarter photographer every day at discovermirrorless.com. It's free. Welcome back to Discover Mirrorless. I'm Jessica Wallach, and today I'm starting my tour of Pro Show Producer. Why do I use Pro Show Producer? I use it to refine my videos I make in Pro Show Web. I upload my photos to Pro Show Web. I choose my music, which is the key reason I use Pro Show Web at all. I let Pro Show Web do a draft of the video, and then I download it into Pro Show Producer to refine it. The first thing I like to do is refine the pacing of my video and the time of particular slides. So, let's just dive right in. I have already downloaded my video. I'll show you where you do that on the watch video screen of Pro Show Web. You click on Open in Pro Show right here under Customize. You will see it render. And then when it's done rendering, you just click right here and it'll download. So I've done all that and I'm ready to go. I want to change the pacing of these headshots. Now, if I just wanted to do one slide, I would click on the right hand corner, lower right hand corner, the little number, and that's the length of your slide. And I would change it. This says two seconds point one one seven. Let's change it to 3.5. So now this slide will go a little slower. Let's say I want to change a number. All of these. I can do that. So let's look at them how they are first. Okay, let's select the group of them by clicking on the first one and then holding down our shift key and clicking on the ones we want. Then we can click on any of the times and we'll change them all to 3.8. And all of them are changed. We can change all of the transitions to 0.5. So let's see what it looks like. There you have how to change your individual slides, how to change a small group. Now, let's say you want to change many, many slides and trying to select them this way would be cumbersome. There's another way to do it. So you choose the slide where you've already changed the time. You right click and you Select Copy Settings Between Slides, and you get all the slides you could, could want to choose your source from. And the one you've already chosen is clicked. You can choose what setting you want to copy. In this instance, we want to copy slide time. And then you can select any or all of the slides. Um, and this is a great way to do a batch. And then you hit copy and close. In this instance, we're just going to close it out. 
And that is how you change your pacing of your videos in Pro Show Producer. Next time I will teach you how to add text to an image. That's one of my favorite things to do. Pro Show Producer is how I will find my videos. I will see. Learning hybrid photography one day at a time. Become a smarter photographer every day at discovermirrorless.com. It's free and phone.